With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Question is for the study of crystal structure, which part of electromagnetic spectrum is used? So here we can say the electromagnetic spectrum, EM spectrum, can be represented as radio wave, microwave, infrared, visible, UV, X-ray. gamma ray and cosmic ray going from left to right we can see here that energy increases or we can say here frequency also increases whereas from right to left here we can say wavelength increases here from left to right wavelength here decreases hence we can say here to study the crystal structure that is whether it is body centered cubic face centered cubic we can use here our x ray we can say here due to its high energy high frequency or low wavelength these x rays are used to just study molecular arrangement that is how electrons are arranged we can use here ultraviolet rays but to study crystal structure we use here x ray and we can see here the wavelength and frequency of these x rays is given here as let's say frequency range is given to be our in the range of 10 power let's say 16 to 10 power we can say as 20 hertz whereas the wavelength range of this x ray here is given to be in the range of we can say here as 10 power minus 8 to we can say here as 10 power minus 12 meter so this x ray is being used to study the crystal structure so option number 4 is the correct answer hence four is our answer for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today